How are we doing folks? Let's get back to some Phasmophobia today. We're going to go into Tanglewood, have a nice little easy quick one. Hopefully, anyway, that's what I'm going for. I want to get in and out straight away. We're taking just one of each equipment, a couple of lighters, a couple of dots, just to make it that little bit easier to spot. Uh, we're going to jump straight in, straight into Tanglewood, because I like to know the area I'm actually hunting in. <laughs> it's nice to be able to go into the house with all three hands full and not have to waste a slot on a torch finding the breaker. Looks like we're in luck and the breaker is upstairs. We'll get a photo, incense and witness a ghost event. Else to report, unfortunately. And the guy has nothing else to report. So Ted Sherman is who we're going to uh, go and find. Let's get to it. Just run straight in, find the ghost room, get the power on straight away. I don't like the fact that that door is ajar. It doesn't look like this is dropping very rapidly in here. Also here seems to be clear. Let's get these lights off. Shut the doors. Check the rest of the rooms. No, he didn't say anything about a cursed, or, a cursed object or bone evidence, human remains, anything like that. Anything in the basement for me? Oh, a Ouija board. That's always handy. Don't need that right now though. Wait, are you serious? Flip the breaker already? What? I only had like two lights on. So that can't have been me, right? Okay, front room's looking clear. Check this room as well. Thinking we're all good so far. As far as the thermometer is showing me. Can I hide in there? Yes, I can. Can I hide in there? Nope. Oh, the nursery door was wide open. And there's a bone in here. And the temperature's dropping. Why does it have to be in the nursery? Oh, wait. To be fair, it didn't drop very much, though. As soon as I stand outside, it starts shooting up. As soon as I go back in, it starts going back down again. All right. I'm going to have to go with that. God, I hate this room as well. Oh. It's fine. We can manage. Let's just get the dots set up and get the hell out of here for now. Got so the moment I can stay on the shelf, lights can go off and out. Not that we've got a camera in there yet, so it doesn't exactly matter, but Okay. I want the UV, I want the ghost writing book, I want the tripod with the camera. Hopefully. Shows us some nice easy signs here. I hate it, but it's in the nursery. It's so creepy. Did you just push a door over there? I thought I heard something. I mean, that is not great placement. I'm not gonna lie. The camera is half inside the wall, but, uh,. I think we might be alright. Let's get this lights off. Get the door closed. Got all the other doors are closed. That one's wide open. That one's closed. Pop back out. Oh, I never put the book down. Of course I didn't.
Right, we've now got a book in there. We've now got the camera set up, and we now have everything else we need in that room, I believe. Well, most of the stuff we need. So I'm just going to sit here and have a quick look at the screen. Right off the bat, don't see any ghost orbs straight away. But, again, they could be right above the camera. They are known to move around the room nowadays. But, yeah, no dots straight away. Nothing in particular looking out of the ordinary right off the bat. So we're going to take the EMF and a crucifix. Keep the UV on us as well. Try and get that done, and then we're going to go and get the camera. Well, that door wasn't open before. Specifically closed it, in fact. No UV there. I just heard something that way. I may be going insane, but. Should have EMS the door already. Maybe a bit late now. Hello? Anybody there? Are you here? Definitely heard something. Hello? Come on, give me something, man. Seriously? Hello? Are you there? Do you like it with the lights off? Is that better for you? Was that that door? Ooh. I don't know why I picked that up, but... Just as I was about to say, I'm getting no EMS whatsoever. Definitely heard a door again. What is that? What is that? I don't understand. So he's just messing with me at this point. Definitely nothing on here. Wait. I can see my breath in here now. Oh my! <laughs> Oh my god, I have never been jump scared by this game so goddamn much. Oh. Oh my god. Oh, that was true terror. I am shaking like an absolute leaf right now. <sighs> well, I witnessed the ghost event. <laughs> uh, I hate my life. I hate this game. Why am I even here? Pelvic ghost with incense. Hmm. Get okay, a motion sensor in there as well. Why not? I'm going to go back for the thermometer now as well. And just hope. God, let's open that door now as well. I may have moved rooms. I'm, I'm dead. I'm a dead man. Oh. Okay, it was a ghost event. Again. Uh, and the crucifix just got burnt. I am so terrified. Oh my god. This ghost is not fun. <laughs> um, just as we were kind of testing if it was in the hallway. Yep, definitely in the hallway now. Which means I've got to move all of the stuff out. No, oh, I'm so scared. <laughs> I'm going to put the camera back. Put the EMF back for now. I can check that a little bit more in a while. I, I need that smudge stick, man. 
I've got to check the temps in here somehow. Wow, I didn't even blow the breaker, it just turned the lights off. That was so damn lucky. Jesus. Give me those dots. Quick. I didn't even use the smudge stick because I was panicking that much. Dots. Done. Camera. And I'm a dead man now. Oh, stop doing that! <laughs> I hate this game! <sighs> right, we can do this. As soon as it sets off this motion sensor. Incense. Oh, it's not chasing me. Oh, okay, now it is! <gasps> wasn't a hunt. Oh my god, these ghost events. Oh. <laughs> it's given us nothing either. Like, we have no evidence whatsoever. And I'm so terrified. Oh, that's something. In fact, I'm on no sanity right now. Uh, all right. Oh, I don't want to go back in there, man. I'm going to have to, though, because we haven't fully checked the MF. Like, I could probably rule UV out because we checked a couple of doors. Uh, it hasn't been written in the book, but it wasn't in the right place. Don't know about dots. I haven't really had a chance to look, but if we cross that out and cross ghost orbs out, it leaves us with four. Now, if we go the fact that I only saw EMF level two or three on the book that was thrown... It leaves us with Moroi. Now, I'm going to hope to Christ that it is Moroi. Let's just read up. The weaker their victims, the stronger it becomes. Yes, okay. It did loads of ghost events in quick succession right at the end when I'm on nothing. It does weaken them for longer periods. Oh, I'm getting out. I'm not even using the sanity medication. I'm, I'm taking that. If it's a Moroi, I'm happy, but... If it's not, I'm also happy to never have to go in that goddamn house again. Oni. Damn. I know I was really fast with ruling stuff out there, but... Oh, I've never been so scared in a game of this in my life. Well, thanks for watching. That's how we get it right next time. See you next time, folks. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Share the video with all your friends. Hit that notification bell. All that jazz. See you next time. Bye.